Hey guys, I've got two tips today. The first is about loading and unloading the bar when it's on the floor, and the second, uh, loading and unloading from the rack. So uh, the first point is um, just because it's not an actual exercise doesn't mean you shouldn't have good form. Uh, so keep your back nice and flat, nice wide stance when you're picking up the plates. Um, so the first one, you can keep it on its side and it's quite easily balanced, and you roll it into place. And then you can just pop it on like this, and then you're going to have nice wide stance, flat back, and you're going to pull towards you. I'm now going to do the same on the other side. So there we go, that's one set, so that's 60 kilos, 20 kilos on each side. Uh, if your plates are like mine, you will find that the second one won't come on and it will brush against the floor. So for this, you're going to get a smaller plate, here's a two and a half kilo plate. You're going to put it underneath and roll the bar up onto it and make sure it's in place and now it's higher up off the ground and you can repeat the same process for the second and third plates or as many as you need to. And then when you're done you're just going to roll it back off and repeat on the other side. When it comes to unloading the deadlift you can do the same process, put the smaller plate on the floor, roll it up onto it and start taking them off one, one at a time. If you've completely unloaded one side, then you might find it easier, depending on the number of plates you have, just to lift it up and tip it. And then you can just pull the bar out, and you've unloaded it. Next up is the same situation, but on the bar, uh, if you remember your maths lessons, this is a moment arm. So you think of each pin uh, as a point in a seesaw. So um, if it's a 20 kilo bar, then it should be able to hold a 20 kilo plate. And it won't tip up. If I wanted it to tip up, I could either add more weight without adding anything on the other side. Or I could take the existing weight and bring it further away from the pivot point. So if I don't want it to tip up, I'm going to push the heavier side so that the weight is as close as possible to the pin. That way I can load several plates and it won't tip up. When it comes to unloading the bar, it's probably safest just to unload one plate at a time from each side. Uh, if you've got a training partner, then they could unload one side at the same time as you're unloading yours, but make sure you go at the same pace. Uh, thank you for watching.